ultimate warrior, and I praise you, but you about to die, son. Yep. You about to die in all kinds of ways of die, okay? You about to die a thousand deaths of deaths. Watch, watch your heart. Your heart gonna stop right now. Look at this. Oh! I think I finally got the Motorola VT71 rolling, uh, running really well. Uh, so I <clears throat> replaced a, a mica cap in the HV cage. I replaced uh, a couple of micas uh, in the vertical and the horizontal. There's still two more, I think, in the horizontal. Uh, <clears throat> and as if you guys remember my first uh, posts regarding this set, I was turning the set on and I was getting pulsing. The the raster was pulsing, the audio was pulsing, uh, and I, I couldn't figure out uh, what was causing it. It was either some type of short or or some... I, I really actually did, couldn't figure it out because um, the set would turn on okay at first. There'd be, there'd be a raster but no picture. And it would be okay for like 30 seconds, and then it would start this pulsing. And then sometimes it would pop back in, and there would be uh, a pretty decent picture and a pretty stable raster. And then sometimes it would pulse for five minutes, and, and I really couldn't figure it out. So after replacing some of those micas, and then I went through the set and checked that, checked for cold solder joints um, for, from some work I had done. Um, I also did put in, uh, I did replace the two selenium rectifiers here with, with two diodes um and fired the set back up and it was still doing it first 30 seconds the set would come on there would be a raster but it would be a flipping raster it would roll um usually usually vertically it looked like it was flipping vertically uh and no matter what i did it would it would do that but it would be a full raster and then it would start the pulsing on, off, HV, up, down, up, down, sound, up, down, up, down, and couldn't figure it out. So I turned the set off and he said, you know what, there's one other thing I haven't done. And I had another 7JP4 uh, CRT. I swapped the C CRT and this is what I got. Perfect, uh, almost a perfect picture. I mean, the picture is really good for a little, um, little tiny electrostatic set. As you can see here, I do have some 60 hertz uh, running from uh, bottom to top, some interference. I believe that is my Agile modulator doing that. Um, my modulator has started humming recently, and um, I notice it uh, on multiple sets when I use my modulator. So I think I have to recap my modulator, um, or something's failing in my modulator. Start, like I said, it started to hum when, it, when it's on. But other than that, this picture looks really good now. The volume's good. And it's very stable. No more pulsing. Everything seems to be running good. The B-plus looks good. It's drawn just over half an amp. Yeah, something like that. At uh, 117 volts, what my Variac set at. So, I mean, it's it's just really good right now. So, something's up with this. I have another... Right here on the floor, I have a spare 7JP4. Something must, there must be a short in it. And it's an intermittent short. And uh, when it shorts, it's causing that pulsing. It has to be something like that. Um, I've never had that happen before with a 7JP4. But if I if I take this picture tube out and swap back in it, does it starts the same thing. So something's up with that, that other 7JP4. This one, which is the one that came, uh, which is the one, this one I believe is the one... Tim Poliniac got me. Um, so, sure looking good now. For the Summers on Up sales event. Bye now. 
eligible Galaxy device and get a free Gear VR virtual reality headset. New Velveeta sandwich breakfast biscuits are for everyone, like the hottest guy at the office. Or the second hottest. The small office. Made with a peanut butter or dark chocolate cream flavored filling. Try New Velveeta sandwich breakfast biscuits. When a beauty named Margarita walked into a bar, Jose Cuervo mixed an icon in her honor. So I think I might replace uh, a few more of the micas uh, in the set and uh, swap some tubes to see if I can get it to uh, get the horizontal to respond a little bit better. But as of right now, as of this evening, I think the majority of the work on this uh, Motorola uh, VT71 is done. One coat guaranteed marquee interior. Bears most advanced paint. Come find our top rated paints only at the Home Depot. Monday, Ninja moves to 98 Central. He was the first American.